The long left thumb is taught to me by Mac O'Grady. It automatically gives you 90 degrees of rest gout. If I go to the short thumb, I lose 15 to 20 percent of that. It puts the pressure in the last three fingers of the left hand. This thumb is dormant. It just lays there. Another good thing, it points directly where I want the shaft to go. That left thumb is pointing that way. Another good thing, it's at 90 degrees to the shaft. If you have a correct right hand grip, it is also at 90 degrees to the shaft. It's the strongest position you can be in. It's also airtight. If you shorten the thumb, you get gaps. Keep it airtight. Thank you, Mac O'Grady. Give it a shot.